what's going on guys it's your boy before i start playing this brand new game let me just throw this out there real quick first off i got really lucky i got so lucky i said what is it thursday uh no tuesday i'm gonna wait do my research and find some sales to buy um certain games like hello neighbor hide and seek at a low low price and um also look for inky and the bendy uh sorry Bandy in the ink machine at a low price as well, right? On a Tuesday. So Wednesday, yesterday, I got a massive discount deal, if I may, in the PlayStation area, known as the Spring Cell. So this happened on a Wednesday, I believe. And I got the games I was looking for, for a low, low price. I think it was like $4.99 for Hello Neighbor Hide and Seek. And then luckily, I found Bandy and the Ink Machine for a low, low price, so it was like the stars were aligning. And here's, the, in case you missed it, here's a message from uh, yesterday I posted. And by the way, uh, any updates, any information um, that goes on the channel or any heads up like that, I'll let you guys know in the community post. So here's one example. It's I got this sucker, this amazing game for $3.99 four dollars super cheap and if you look closely if i may again and open it up it costed let me get a little closer myself 19.99 20 dollars that was on a tuesday by the way that was the og price but i waited on wednesday after my stream and then i got it for available for 3.99 so i got the two games i wanted it at a low price all i had to do was wait till wednesday and yeah uh, I got another game on sale from the Spring Sales from PlayStation, so I won't say what it is. It's a surprise, but I got a good deal out of it. So yeah, it's all working out, guys. I don't know, maybe I'm just really lucky, but uh, I'm, I'll take it. I'm not gonna, you know, like, uh, not waste this opportunity. So anyways, let me just get this out of the way. So yeah, I'm playing, I'm gonna be playing Bendy and the Ink Machine for the very first time. So if you know this game, no spoilers to me. I want to play this like blind, not literally, and see how it plays out. Also, I forgot to mention Hello Neighbor, the continuation from last time, Act 3, the finale, to the final act. I'm going to move that next week just to just to change the content because, you know, I love Hello Neighbor as much as the next guy, but back to back to back, you know, we got to mix it up. So here we are with the Bendy and Dick machine to help us with that. So again, Hello Neighbor, Act 3, the finale, next week. So, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, one of those days. So yeah. But also real quick, Dr. Reflex is real, says, yes, I am first. Yes, that is true. You are indeed first. How's it going? Uh, man says, I love you, Neko. Hey, hey, take it easy. Take it easy, man. I'm not into that parasocial. We're homies here. We're homies, but that's about it. We don't go any further than that. <laughs> Uh, also, Mornix, what is up? Mornix, man, how you doing? Sheesh, are you... Wait, man, how you doing? How you doing, man? Long time no see. How, how's it? How's things? Also, the game order is Bandy and the Ink Machine, Boris and the Ink Machine, oh, that's the mobile game, and then Bandy and the Dark Revival. Now, that I've seen. Sadly, it's not at a low price. That's, like, still $20, I think. But, um, just like I did Tuesday, I'm going to wait. And wait till the price to drop because I might get lucky again. It might be for four ninety nine or maybe lower. And I can't wait to hear you scream about chapter one. Uh, hey, no spoilers, no spoilers. I, 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 you're making it sound like it's something else in this game, like, like scary. So if it's a scary game, okay, but that's it. No, no hints, no hints. Well, anyways, how's it going, guys? It's Thursday. I'm ready to go. But since it's Thursday, I, I have to do my best to keep it two hours because I got to work on Friday. So I'm going to need all the sleep, the eats. Well, actually, eat first, chill, and then sleep because your boys got to work on Friday. So for those who don't know, I work Friday through Sunday, but I'll be back on Monday. Just keep that in mind in case you're new or in case you don't know. So that being said, two hour stream today. I'm going to try to compress as much as I can under those two hours. And it's been five minutes. So let's not waste time, shall we? Because <laughs> uh, we were on a time crunch. But also, hello, Glitch and White Skeleton. How's it going? This is a very good game. Uh, yeah, you guys told me to check this game out. And here I am. I'm here to deliver. So, like I said, without further ado, 
playing for the first time Bendy in the Ink Machine. Let's go meet somebody named Bendy. Like the title. Oh boy. Yeah, actually, it's you guys and my sister. My sister told me to play this, but I told her no spoiler, so no worries on that department. Rooster Teeth! Who remembers these guys? Yeah, it, it didn't end well for them. Sadly. Yeah, the, they're the guys I watch Ruby. Alright, let me drop it down a couple of decibels. Bendy in the ink machine, and we have that face, the thumbnail. Um He seems nice. She I don't know, maybe I don't know, maybe it's a girl, I don't know. But uh, options. Let's see. Good, that's all we need. That's all we need. Subtitles. See, I like to read. I need to know what's going on. But there's also tips, which are, I assume, hints. Sensitivity 25. What's the highest? What's the highest? Because I'm a Call of Duty lad. I, I need that speed. Let's go for 65. And everything else, we'll leave the brightness as is because we want to enjoy the experience they want us to play in with the, with, with the lighting, however they want us to. Yeah. So let's go back. Oh yeah, I forgot there will be hints at the top of the screen. That's fine. Hey, I won't take those hints. From the game though, y'all, you can't help me on this one. Listen, hello neighbor, by all means come through. But over here, chill. <laughs> I got this. I'm a professional. Also, seriously, Monday, that's a school day. Uh, yeah, I, I, yeah, I know. I'm sorry. For some of y'all, must suck. Cause, uh, yeah, for you, you have school, but for me, I have a day off. So, <laughs> hey, you can wish you got the vlog. Also, let's go right into it. I did promise that, right? So, begin. Hajime. <laughs> Save one. Yes, please. New game. I'm not even gonna look at the chapters. I don't wanna know. No spoilers. Dear Henry, it seems like a lifetime since we worked on cartoons together. 30 years, damn, really slips away, doesn't it? If you're back in town, come visit the old workshop. There's something I need to show you. Your best pal, Joey. Drew, not Joey Wheeler from Yu-Gi-Oh, but damn, really 30 years? So I must be a millennial or something. Work hard, work happy. Bendy and the little devil darling. It's giving me like retro cartoons like old Mickey, like Mickey Steamboat, like old cartoons. Chapter one, moving pictures. All right, Joey. I'm here. Let's see if we can find what you wanted me to see. Discover Joey's secret. Tip, search the workshop. I love the design. Very cartoony and classy. And yeah, like I was saying, it reminds me of Mickey Mouse, like the old version of him. Because of the, the art style and the gloves. Bendy and the Dancing Demon. Five cents. Buy bonds. Presented, presented in silver... Silly visions. Wow. I'm, I don't know. Maybe these are like DLCs or future games, right? Bandy the Little Devil Darling, maybe? Just speculating. We got Goofy out here. Bandy and Sheep Songs with Boris the Wolf. Okay, so your name is Boris. And I assume you're Bandy, right? That's crazy. Oh, speak of the devil. I assume Bendy is this one, right? I'm just guessing, by the way. <laughs> I I'll, The only thing I know about this is the title and the cover, which is the, the face of this individual, but that's about it. A very unique art style. And there's a sequel, by the way. Bendy and the revival of something. Somebody mentioned in the chat. So it must be good, because they don't give sequels to nobody. It's got to be. It's got to hit. Also, I was not watching. I'm so sorry. I missed all the streams. Sorry, bro. You don't, guys. You gotta stop apologizing. You don't owe me anything. If you, if you, if you can, if you want to, come through. If not, all good. You guys don't owe me nothing. It's all good. This isn't spoilers, but here's the main characters: Bandy and the Ink Demon, Boris the Wolf, Alice the Angel. All right. So I met the, yeah. Well, not met in person, but Boris the Wolf. So I have a visual. And Bendy the guy, dang, wait, hold on, Bendy the demon. Oh, the hell did that slip my radar? Yeah, I, I don't think they, yeah, <laughs> Bendy, 
Insert middle name demon. Yeah. That's not suspicious. Let me look around real quick. We have the exit. And this signs. Is this the ink machine, the theater, the break room, and the art department? So it's like a Joey Drew Studios. So we are an artist, right? And we're about to find some secrets. Uh, what's his face secrets? Golly, y'all need to get somebody to fix this. What if a rat comes out of this? Oh, man. I know I was talking about Mickey, but we don't want that kind of rat. Bandy and the demon. Yeah, that doesn't scream suspicious at all. Now I can read my previous messages. Okay, so please keep in mind, I won't be able to read everybody's messages like I do in most games. Due to, you know, gameplay reasons. It's kind of difficult. I hope you guys can understand. But uh, for this one, so let me go up here. Dr. Re Reflex says, okay, so only hints when you get stuck, right? Um, yeah, if I, if I'm, if I say, guys, can you help me out? And if you really want to, by all means. But right now, the game gives me hints, too. And I think this game might be linear. You know, point A to point B. So I don't think I can get lost. But just guessing, by the way. Also, by the way, I'm not sure if this will cause epileptic seizure. So if you're sensitive to stuff like this, strobes, don't don't watch. I don't know if there's going to be more of this, but I can handle it. But for some of y'all, I don't know. Maybe don't check it out. Oh boy. Bandy's everywhere. He's literally everywhere. Hey, how's it going? I'm kind of new around these streets. Is there something behind you? No, but there's another copy of himself. Okay, he's... That's, yeah, awesome. Let's keep looking. This game is seven years old, and the sequel was made a year ago. Wow. So, 2017. Golly. Those were the good years. Let me tell you that. That's when Fortnite was booming. Yes, I'm a big Fortnite fan. So, yeah. Holy crap. I mean, there's other things that came out in 2017, but that's one of the big ones for me. Because I was like there and then. I was there in that moment. Sorry. <laughs> Got the sniffles. Uh, let's see. Bandy and the Dancing Demon. Oh, boy. Hey, Bandy. It's like. I felt like I just passed you by, and now here you are. Hey, here's my old desk. I wasted so much time in this chair. Oh god, that's your chair, bro. You need that upgrade, bro. You need that gamer chair. I mean, I can't. Okay, I can't really talk like that because I don't have a gamer chair at the moment. But you need something better. I currently have like this old office chair I had since I was a kid, so it's still it's still holding nicely. But I will upgrade soon. But this doesn't look so bad, right? Uh, you know, drawing cartoons, making people happy, getting creative, you know? But with that chair, that's gonna be a pain. I'm gonna need some, I need a pillow on that. Two pillows for my bottoms and for my backs. But apart from that, yeah. Yeah, there's a lot of flashing lights in this game, so seizure warning, guys. Yeah, if you, I, I, I don't know if I missed it when I was just talking when, when starting this game, but look out for possible seizures, you know, with lights. So yeah, y'all been warned. But anywho, like they knocked out a wall or two after I left. Guess it took a few people to replace me. Dang, replaced. Work hard, work happy. Yeah, <laughs> motivation. Oh Sam, we have another one. This is different. It says delicious. Briar label bacon soup, and on the bottom it says. Made from traditional family recipes. Briar label bacon soup. Tastes like some home kitchen cooking that mom used to make. Just like the way the little devil likes it for 12 cents. I never had bacon soup in my life. I had, um, what's it called? Broccoli and cheddar soup. But never bacon soup. I'm, I mean, I'm down for it because I like bacon, but... Hmm. Uh, <laughs> kind of an odd... Mixture, if you ask me. No vegetables in there? No carrots? No? Another one, but this one looks... I mean, it has the same hairstyle, but I feel like this is a different... character. I might be wrong, but I'm just saying. Hey, Bandy! 
Hi. <laughs> small town, isn't it? Or is it small world? Everywhere I go, I see Bendy. I feel like that Spider-Man meme, you know? Everywhere I go, I see him. And there he is. <laughs> oh, boy. Okay. Oh, for a second there, I thought that was a camera. <laughs> and this current age, there's no way. There's not going to be cameras in here. Bacon soup is a healing item, by the way. Oh, I didn't know that. Oh, I thought it was just food. Cool. Alright, so we're supposed to find his secrets. Hey, Bendy! Do you clog the toilet? Because if you did, you are an ass. <laughs> well, that's everybody's toilets. And there seems to be some sort of black stuff in the corner. Very suspicious. Okie dokie. Let's go somewhere else, unless we can mingle with this. Bye, Bandy. Bye, Bandy. Joey Drew Studios. Alright, so it's called Bandy and the Ink Machine. We've met plenty of Bandy. I think we should probably meet up the Ink Machine at this point. Dreams come true. Oh, boy. Is this censored? Because there are some animes that they turn blood from red to black or white. So, that may be censored blood. <laughs> Or perhaps it just be, could be ink. Due to the title of the game. Dreams come true. If that, if only that were true, then everybody will probably be happy. Maybe. Unless their dreams collapses with the other. You know, my dream is for world peace. And some crazy person. My dream is for, for uh, war and destruction. Yeah, maybe not so much. Maybe not so much. Hey, who's hey who's who's uh, who's messing around? You're supposed to be working, bro. Work hard and work and be happy or something like that. He's probably playing Tetris or something. Ink machine. Joey Strew Studios ink output schedule: nineteen gallons. 13 and 18 and so forth. Golly. Y'all use that much gallons of ink? Dang. I can only assume how much paper you guys even use. Like probably like a forest to make all these cartoons. By the way, he made Bendy and Bendy is the mascot of Joey Drew Studios as the white skeleton. And Mr. Patrick says, yo, I'm back from... Oh, really? Oh, snap. Italy. Oh, my God. I'm so jealous. The land of the pizza. <laughs> And the spaghetti and the olive oils. Well, I, I'm just joking. There's more to that than to Italy. I, I mentioned they have great art and music. But you on back from Italy? Well, or what are you playing? I first off, Patrick, welcome back from Italy. And second, I am playing Bendy in the Ink Machine for the first time. So right now you're you're on time. You have you didn't miss much. All I saw was a bunch of bendies everywhere. Press X to jump. Watch your step. Okay. This lift could use a few dry cells. So, batteries. Okay, so where do we get batteries? Excuse me. Ah. Hey, Bandy. Is there another one behind me? Ceiling? They should just put a Bandy on the ceiling, just for giggles. <laughs> then I can actually fully say he's everywhere. Because he's in the- he's in the- he's on the side of the corners. He's in the toilet. Not in the toilet, but around the toilet. He's, he's everywhere. How do I get this, though? Was it triangle? Square? It's not the square button. It's circle. Circles to grab. Circles to grab and to jump. That's going to be very confusing. So let's put on these batteries. Let's see what you're hiding down there, old friend. So is this normal? I don't work at a art studio, but I don't think they have this, right? I'm just guessing, by the way. Again, I don't work in an art studio. <laughs> this, yeah, we have this in the back. Every everywhere you go in an art studio, we have this in the back for you know, if we need more pens, more ink, paper, uh, you name it, it's in the back. 
down there into the abyss, naturally. Also, Neku, can you read the previous messages? It's just a fact. Also, can you read my previous... Guys, like I said, I won't be able to read messages, like, consistently. I, I got... See, I'm trying to provide more gameplay. But, um, by the way, he made Bendy the... He made Bendy in the Bendy's the mascot of Joey Drew Studios, says Skeleton. And also read my fact. And John says, cool. Uh, you can get an achievement if you drink the bacon soup in every chapter. See, that's... Uh, okay, okay. Um, Try turn her away in the desk and then look again. Okay. I, okay, I'll try. I'll, I'll try. But, yeah. I, I'm sorry, guys. I can't read everyone's messages, but it's hard to balance gameplay and commentary and read chat and respond to every message at the same time. I, I'm not that good. I, I need an assistant. Assistant, please, if you make, you read what they're saying while I provide gameplay. Well, of course, Neku. Ah! I got something. I assume it's the bacon soup. Not sure how I missed it, though. So you said go to the... Oh, I'm sorry. Let me go scroll down. Oh, sad fact. I've never eaten Domino's pizza. Are you for real? Sheesh. Good thing you're talking to me, not my sister. She hates Domino's pizza because of the recipe. But I keep telling her the recipe changed, so it's better now. I assume it's this, right? Oh my god, still there! <laughs> Herringstein made Bendy. Herringstein. Uh, maybe this is not the right one. Perhaps it's this one. The Bendy on the table. Oh my god, he's still there! We is playing as him. Herringstein. Herringstein. Okay, okay. I gotta keep this in mind. There's a lot of work. I, there's a lot I have to work with with all this information. Maybe it's this one. Guys, I'm going back now. <laughs> is that why Domino's is actually good now? Um, yeah, Domino's is pretty neat. You know what's funny? For years, I said this since we're talking about this particular company. I said I was gonna get Domino's for a very long time, but I always procrastinate. And then always buy end up like Papa John's. You know why? Because Domino's in my area is a tad bit far, but Papa John's is like, like, figuratively speaking, around the corner. It's meaning it's really close. But yeah, I if I could if I could get some Domino's, I'll go for the original crust, pepperoni, um, extra large if they have it, and one Brooklyn style. It's been a minute since I Brooklyn. But yeah, Domino's Pizza, <sighs> yummers. Now you guys make me hungry. Maybe I should get some pizza tonight. <laughs> if I can make the effort to go get it, because it's a long drive. If we're going for Domino's, of course. Let's see, circle. Wow. What the heck? Jesus. Is that the ink machine? That looks like a part for a tank. Like the engine or something. Turn on the ink machine. Locate the power station. That's the tip. That's the objective. And there's the ink. Which I probably need some height, right? Very simple. I like it. Just ink. Not what kind of ink. <laughs> um cool because you know in colors it's not just red and white there's also like red burgundy hot pink baby blue which i said to someone that that doesn't exist and they proved me wrong and i ate my worst that day because baby blue sounds like it sounds made up until they show me the label <laughs> but cool it's the ink machine indeed it's very huge and awfully heavy but we're supposed to mess with this, apparently. Fun fact, Bendy and the Ink Machine figures are really rare nowadays. Hopefully they're cheaper if they're, you know, if we can find them. Compared to Hello Neighbors figures, which are, what are, what are they again? $100 and some change? But yeah, that is just crazy. Alright, so the question is, how in the world do we proceed from here? Do we just, like, jump? 
Uh, okay, let's go somewhere else. Maybe something open up in the back. Very, what a very peculiar game. So, Bendy, the demon, Boris the wolf, and a giant ink machine. And bacon soup, of all things. I'm sorry, bacon's good, but in a soup format? I, I don't know about that one, though. Because that's almost as crazy as bacon ice cream, at least to me. Uh, how do we... Of course, Neku, circle, genius. But now that I did that, I wonder... I guess I caught them. Um, no, sir, I'm not playing Tetris. I was doing my job, which I very much love. Wow. It's kind of cramped in here. Yeah, these are the dark ages. We have candles, bro. Where are the lights at? <laughs> where are the natural lights? You know, the windows and with the sun. He will set us free. Now, that reminds me of... Uh, Poppy's Playtime. The... Pro the... The, what, what do you call it? Not the projector, but the, the prototype. He will set us free. And there seems to be a, a Vinny. How the, how do you crouch? This is Bendy. Jesus, Bendy's everywhere. All I see is Bendy. But I can't crouch. I guess I'm too tall. But we can get this, which is bacon soup. Dude, I'm gonna get fat. <laughs> I'm gonna be very fat. I, I'm just calling it right now. So, uh, yeah, I've, um, I didn't say this out loud, but yeah, there's nobody here. Very suspicious. So... From the vibes of it, it's very spooky. So I assume it's a scary game, right? Not a single soul in sight. Words on the wall, or... Yeah, wording. there's words on the wall that, like, you know... Was it again? I forgot. I'm sorry. My short-term memory is so bad, but... That's not normal, is what I'm trying to say. That's not normal. Can't get that. But, y'all said bacon soup is, what, healing? So I'm not gonna waste it. I'm gonna leave that right there. Because if there's healing, that means I can get hurt. From someone or something. That's kind of creepy. A piece to gods? <laughs> Wait a minute, bro. What are you... What is he... What is he... What is he sacrificing? Did he made a deal with the devil? What was going on, man? That, uh, that That's kind of suspicious, man. Hey, old friend. We need to talk after this. What have you done? Also, you can't get her in chapter one. Okay. So I was correct, I can't get hurt. So for now they're giving me a, a nice, you know, hey, we'll take it easy on you, buddy. But chapter two, who you're so screwed. Bacon, ink, but not a single soul in sight. Not my buddy, nor the workers. And there he is, that little devil or demon. I just ink pressure. Circle, circle, circle. I can't mingle with this, so for those who are asking, can you press circle? It does not work. I'm, I'm sorry, I'm just admiring this environment. It's just look at it, it just tells a story. So this is where they watch the the, the rough drafts, the, the final products, the skits, the bits, the reels, and they eat here too. Perhaps if I may, Yes, whatever occurred made everyone disappeared. Hmm? Something went horribly wrong. Just just a speculation, just a guess, if you will. Cause not I don't see nobody. Look at the webs. That tells you this 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 been 
like this for for probably years. Nobody's been here for a minute. So something went wrong, and I'm here to figure out what that is. Look at that. If you've been working here, you, you pretty sure, I'm pretty sure there'll be a lot of complaints from the HR guy or lady. Be like, hey, got to get somebody to fix this. Rats. Not cool. Rats and all kinds of diseases through that crack hole. Hey, welcome back, Jelly Bean. How's it going? You can't activate it right now, says Jelly Bean. Okay, so he, so you play this game. Okay, no spoilers. And hi. Uh, after the neighbor, AI will start to talk to you and say she'll destroy the game. What? The AI? Slowly the world will start glitching out and you'll be able to go to the moon. That sounds like spoilers. No spoilers. Because that actually sounds pretty cool and intense. And there he is again. Bendy. Please. Stop freaking me out. Wow. <laughs> I'm good. I survived the fear. We, we're doing pretty good. I mean, that could have been a little bit better. You know what? If, if I were to walk like here and they dropped it, that would have given me a scare. Uh, like a skip of a heartbeat. Like a jump. But that was a bit too... Mm, could have been better. Just saying. A little helpful critique if... Oh. Hold on. Is there an exit? <laughs> oh, boy. What the frick? It's Boris the Wolf. Or Goofy. Oh, my God. Joey, what were you doing? Oh, my God, indeed. Dude, this is some dark magic. Look at that. Boris the freaking wolf. Is there anything I can use like a like armor? A weapon? Who's laughing now? Oh, that's for Hello Neighbor. Oh, I was about to say, no spoilers for Bendy. Oh, but okay. I mean, that's no spoilers, but you know. Cool. Glitching? Mamo? Dang. Okay, so dang, that's freaking cool. Let me chill, let me chill, let me chill, let me chill. Let me observe. It looks like Boris has some sort of ranch that maybe I can use. And uh, this looks kind of legit. Like a real person. Holy crap. Okay, so we can, we can mark it on the, on the, the list. Horror game. Check. Possible seeing demons. Oh yeah, it's, I can feel it. Hopefully, Bendy's one of the good ones, because I feel like that guy's going to attack me. Ink. And posters. I know there's a path I missed, but uh, let me just peek over here for a moment. Bacon soup. Okay, we went full circle. This was where the very poor attempt to get jump scared happened. And there's a um, wolf boy. We'll go right. The ink machine. This is low right, pressure. Get this to work. Fix the ink machine. Locate and place the objects. Golly, it looks like somebody exploded. Can you see it? It's like a medium to large size body, and then bam, pop. Oh yeah, and it's not spoilers. It's um, that's for the yeah yeah. You're right. You're right. From Hello Neighbor. Yeah, 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 my bad, my bad. I assume is what it was for. I thought it was for this game, my bad. It says, no, you said that's a wrench. You're supposed to pull it out. Oh, for real? Let me try again. <laughs> oh my God, it's Bendy. Oh, hey, buddy. How's it going? I missed, you know, it's been quite a long time by that man, few seconds. Is he? Do we I'll need this here? I don't know, man. Damn it! I thought Bendy was a good one. No, no, Bendy's not. That's this is hitting all levels of creep factor. Okay, maybe he's the good one, right? He looks like he's um, he don't want any of this. But ah, uh, yes, I got the ranch. I ain't talking about the sauce. Now, how do I? Oh. Fix the ink machine, locate and place the objects. It tells you right here, and there's like just three simple things. So we have a cog, a ranch, 
and we have a few other things we have to get. So there's a Vinny, the disc. I know where to find that. I, I literally ran into it, but I couldn't get it because it was like underneath my feet. But anyways, I know the spot. Scary Bendy Wendy. Yeah, oh my god, not gonna lie. It didn't scare me like, like, Jesus, like, jump out of my chair, but it did creep me out. It's like being stalked. Not a good feeling. It says low pressure. We'll see about that. Circle, circle, circle. So I, I assume we need some ink. Oh! Ah, oh, I see you. Oh, so I am so dumb. How did I miss this? There's a ranch behind us. I was so fixed on this pillar. We need a cog, which I think we have. I'm a liar. I don't have it. However, at least I have something to look forward to getting, which is a cog. All right, let's go find the pieces, shall we? Hey, how's it going? Bye. <laughs> Okay, holy crap. Y'all, look, I'm gonna trust you guys. You said I cannot be hurt in chapter one, right? I'm gonna take your word. Chapter two, holy shoot. I had to be mentally ready for that bullcrap. And there's no, there's no, um, picture. It's gone. I don't know. Actually, I don't know if there was something there to begin with, but still. Oh, man. Oh, uh, you also have to find Bendy doll. This a carton will scare you a lot of times. Well, it did a good job. <laughs> I mean, what, what? Why? What? Am I a threat? I'm just a guy trying to see a secret from a friend, right? I'm not here to cause any trouble. I'm just here to find something out. Yeah, there's there's no need to get all um hostile, you bendies. Me, friend. Also, what in the world? <gasps> ah! Let's try out my aiming skills. I just lost ten dollars. I made some money back. All right, let's go. Let's go a little bit higher. <gasps> Ooh! Okay. That was not me, by the way. That was clearly somebody else. I'm not sure if I'm supposed to. Hmm. Let me try that again. Maybe I'm supposed to get it on the dot. Maybe I get like a nice little reward. A little bit to the left. Ooh, come on. That's... Okay. Bullcrap. Where's my toy? Or where's my $10? Or $20 since I won that bet? <laughs> it's cool. Worth a shot. Ah. The Illusions of Living by Joey Drew, I assume. Don't forget to punch in. It could save your job. Always on time. Yes. <laughs> the old grind. Oh boy. See, Benji, I'm doing good. I'm I'm clocking on the job. Don't attack me, please. I think he knows already. We've been sending him our best pal, Joey Drew. Yeah. Good old Joey. Very clever, by the way. Joey Drew, as in drawing. Super smart. Danger, keep out. Work hard, work happy. Haha, <laughs> yay. Okay, so we got one of the pieces, I assume. It's the the little book. So now we just need a Bendy doll, the Vinny, and a Madrosco doll, maybe? Kind of small. All right, let's see. Where have we explored? Let's see. Maybe this way. Wait. Let me double check. Let me double check. It doesn't hurt. Ah, see? What did I say? It's glowing. Now we have the cog. Now we just need... Let's see. The, 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 three items. Three items. I'm not really sure how I missed it the first time, but because if you think about it, it was there and I had to open it. So that had a server purpose and the purpose was to get the cog, but I 
<laughs> seemed to get carried away. And there's the Vinny, which now is glowing. Hmm. Cool. He will set us. No. He will set us free. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He will set us free. Oh, that's saving the game. Oh, okay. So, okay. I legit thought we were supposed to do that for, you know, for some lore. But. Cool. Now, not to save the game. Dreams come true. Ah, yes. Now, where's that little bendy doll? It might be a little difficult because dolls are usually small, but it's a bendy, so <laughs> it shouldn't be that hard to find, right? It's not this thing or this sticker. Not sure what purposes I serve. Let me turn it off. <laughs> Hopefully, Bendy doesn't get upset with me. <laughs> mm. Just making sure. I swear I heard some creaking noises. Almost as someone's trying to follow me. Oh, what are they thinking? Bacon soup? That doesn't even sound healthy. I mean, it's tasty, but uh, let's be real. Maybe not the healthiest thing to consume. Hey, Bandy, do you have the toy in there? Is it in the toilet? I kind of need it if you have it. Nick, you've seen it before. You even said there's Bandy himself. I did? Did I really say that? I'm sorry, I just say a lot of things, I just... Ah! Hey, look! Hey! Hey! We... Okay, so it's not a Madruska doll, it's actually an ink. Now we just need Bendy! But you said I I seen him pass by. Oh, not pass by, but like, seen it. Alright, let me go back. Not, see, not a wasted trip. I got what I needed. So, back to the sticker. Or is it this, perhaps? It's not glowing, so I can't really pick it up. Oh my god, I, I can feel it. I can feel it. Boris the wolf, man. He, he's kind of like... Semi-chained. But when I when I get the feeling he's about to chase me, like um, Like a cat and dog. Or is it a cat and mouse? It's not the sticker. All right, so it's not this one. It's clearly somebody else. Not uh, not somebody else, but different. Um, Bendy. The Bendy that was sitting on the chair. Nani. Okay. Thank you for the the help. You said chair. Let me go back. Not here. I wonder. I'm just speaking out loud, but I wonder if Bendy's like a reference to Mickey Mouse, but like their version of it. I feel like you'll be very popular, you know? Mickey's Mickey, but Bendy's Bendy. Let me go find another location. So far, no luck. Neku, not gonna lie, you really sound like Henry. Who? Henry? Wait. Henry Drew? Or a different kind of Henry? Cool. Nope. Where is that little doll? Chair, Neku, chair. Can't forget chair. So once we get the pieces, we have to go to that one spot, and then we're, pr we're practically set. Hello, Bendy. You wouldn't happen to know where I can find a small version of yourself, would you? This is going to be a, a bit of a doozy. 
Here, let me ask Boris the Wolf. Boris the Wolf, do you know where your friend Bendy is? No, okay, thank you for your assistance. <laughs> I hate to say this, but I think he's dead. His eyes are kind of like X'd, like X marks. All right, for the meantime, we can at least place these down. There we go. The cog, the ranch, the book. And how, in a kind of a funny way, kind of fitting, the last thing is Bendy itself. Henry, the guy you play as, um, you should like him. Oh, what's not to like? Can't wait to meet him. Mr. Henry. Mr. Henry Drew. We went there, so let's go over here. That's the recording. There's a chair, and there's a... Oh, God! Oh, my God! Jesus! Wow! <laughs> Now that was a scare. <laughs> Bendy the frick. <laughs> now see. Now that's how you do it. That's how you scare a person. The thing that have This. No oh, actually. I'm not sure if it's a. Hold on. The one with the word where it fell off. Could have been like that. That same fear. It just you had to work on the timing. But that was gold. Golly. <laughs> Hey, 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 Vandy. Working hard, not being lazy. Where's the... Where's the doll? Where's the doll? Is it in there? I can't I can't tell. All I see is cardboard. <laughs> Scary Vandy. Jesus, man. Golly. Oh, my God. <laughs> it's gonna be fine. It's chapter one. We're, we're okay. The worst that can happen is just a bunch of jump scares, but that's about it, right? Where in the world? Right. Oh! I found it! Bendy! There he is! Get over okay, here! That's all of them. How did I miss him? Ink pressure... Oh, right! I was talking about watching movies and them eating food in here. Yeah, yeah, okay. Oh snap. Oh my god, I didn't miss him. Okay. I'm I'm just sorry, I'm just feeling a little silly. Like, how did I miss him? My observations are kind of like not perfect, but not that bad. He kind of stood out just a little bit. Like the moment I turned, I saw him immediately. I guess yeah, okay. I, I gotta sharpen my my observation skills just a little bit more. Also, Henry, the guy you play, you sound like him. Also, see you sound the same. I do? I, I need to hit that replay, though. I was so fixing on, on finding the, the silly doll. But, yeah. Maybe he's my long lost twin. You know what's funny? I too am an artist as well. <laughs> From time to time. But most of the time, I usually just play games. But when I do draw, I try to do my best to draw best waifus. And yeah, let's place the final piece right here. Now I just need to get the ink flowing somehow. Should be a switch around here somewhere. Then I can start up the main power. Restore ink pressure. Locate the pressure valve. Also, uh, pick up the pieces trophy. Nice. Uh, the ink thing, I think I've seen that before. But in a different room. I think it's over here. Or maybe it's over here, actually. Let me take a quick peek. Hey, Boris, how's it going? Who's laughing now? Clearly not me. I stand corrected. It's probably somewhere else. The valve. The valve. It's gotta be here somewhere. The ink machine. I'm gonna go this way. Watch your step. Or maybe not. This is where you put the batteries and okay. I stand corrected stand corrected once again. I'm sorry for this part saying what are you guys talking about? <laughs> what, what, what's going on, man? <laughs> Actually don't don't answer that. That's kind of spoilers, but I'll go into soon something bad's gonna happen. <laughs> 
better get overtime for this. Please save the game. I don't like this. This is some bull crap. Where in the world? You know, you mentioned I figure out where everything is at, but sadly that's not the case. There. This no. Oh. Never mind. I was looking for the signs. You know where it says like the ink machines over here and over there's the the other thingy. I was looking for that. Oh, here it is. The break room? Nope. The ink machine? Nope. So either the theater or the art department. I'm going to the art theater. Maybe it's over here. The room where you go where the, oh we got the bendy doll, that's where you have to go? Oh okay. To the theater room. Also there's an exit, which I'll peek for two seconds. Whoop, that was disappointing. <laughs> so I think the thing the place where I got bendy was over here. Mm, wait a minute, I might have be yeah, I think I'm wrong. Never mind. <laughs> you know what? Whatever. Whatever's about to happen. I was going to say good, but obviously bad or worse. I'm ready for it. <laughs> I'm, I, I can run. I can fight. Well, I'm not sure if my character can do that. There are certain games where characters can't do any of those things, like Outlast. And they, all they can do is just like... Most of the time, hide. Not much fight. Regardless, I will try to survive. That's the break room. And the doll must be, without a doubt, in this corner. I, I uh, said correct. Bendy! Bendy! This is a place. <laughs> oh boy. Hey, look at that. Simple. Adorable. So what, am I supposed to just watch a secret code or something? I, I wish I could dance. I can jump. Yes. I am too am Bendy. I yeah, I'm Henry slash Bendy. I don't get it. Oh, I got you. <laughs> nope. Hold on. Maybe I need some tapes or something. Oh, right. The ink pressure. Genius, of course. There we go. Oh, s snap. Okay, that's not supposed to happen. Oh, I'm gonna get fired for this one. Okay, so don't do anything weird, bro. Cool. Turn on the ink machine. Yeah, of course. Yeah, now it's I'm hearing noises. What is up with that? Bendy? There's probably a good reason why the ink machine was turned off, and I assume not for the obvious, you know, because they weren't using it. It's probably the source of all evil. He's not moving, so I'm a happy lad. <laughs> Alright, so... Alright, ready? Sure. I got your ink. Now, where's my buddy? What's his face? Running. I don't get it. Turn on the ink machine. But, sir, I did. Actually, what the, hap what the hell happened on the lights? 
Why the, why is everything so dark? Oh my god, is he please tell me he's not gonna get up. Oh my god, please don't. Hey Boris, my favorite How you doing? Oh oh L there's something coming out of his chest. You know what, if you guys excuse me, I'm going to go literally anywhere else. Where's the exit? It's getting a little creepy now. So I did what you told me to do. Does it want me to go to the ink machine where I found it? The, the big piece of metal? Because if so, I could do that. Speak of the devil, there it is. The title, ink machine. Oh! <gasps> Oh shoot! Oh hell no! Wait, wait, wait! Hold on. Let me, let me, let me get into this. Let me get into this. What's going on? Oh god! Oh my god! Run! Oh, oh shoot! Oh shoot! Escape the workshop! Oh my god! Okay, okay. Damn! Oh my god! Okay, so what the? Was that Bendy? Exit this way. Exit. Okay. Thank God for reading. No! Hello, Bendy. Oh, that was Bendy. Drain the ink, find and turn the valves. Oh, Jesus, that was mildly aggressive. He was in my face. I will admit there was a door I could have interacted with, but I'm hoping that doesn't, like, ruin what's going on. I feel like there might be a, an important piece in there. Maybe like a weapon or something. That was hilarious. That was not funny. Jesus, what the frick? He's... Oh my god, whatever, man. <laughs> nice to meet Bendy. That's all I need to hear. Joey Drew, up to no good. And he said, the machine is not normal. That has to be some sort of demonic machine. It's like, I, I'm going to guess, right? I'm just, I'm going to La La Land. Joey made a deal. Joey made a deal to make his creations come to life with the devil. And the devil created him. He either created him the machine or gave him the dream, the, 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 the blueprints in his head. And he's like, here, follow these instructions to make your dreams come true, your wish. And the plot twist is, his creations turn into demons. Just a big reach, big old guess, but I, I don't know, maybe I'm cooking here or something. I think I'm cooking. Jeez. Imagine, imagine, imagine when that happened, I was like, okay, I survived, guys, that's it, I'm done. Stream's over, bye, see you next Monday. <laughs> nope. <laughs> No, I'm I'm scared, but more slightly curious. I want to see how that plays out. Ink Demon is coming for you, but why? Danger, keep out. Yeah, seriously, thank God for reading. I was like, "Where's the exit?" And it was like, "Exit this way, exit that way." Nice. But now we have the power to run, which is going to be very useful. Bruh. Watch your step? More like, watch my mouth. I don't want to get any of this stuff in my mouth. That's ink. Could be poisonous. Oh boy. Hold your breath. <gasps> Dude, I swear, if I wish there was a mirror. I, I feel like once I look at the mirror, I'm gonna be like half... Like, like 75% black, 25% white in the face. <laughs> And maybe my fingers... No, my fingers are doomed. Look, my, my hands are in there. But my face is still, like, up here. 
If I survive this, the wife's gonna be like, "What happened to you?" Uh, I really don't want to. I don't want to talk about it. I really don't. Know. I want to take a shower, a hot, hot shower, and uh, maybe Home Depot, because this ink is just not gonna probably come off with hot water, actually. Nice. There goes my Nikes, my Jordans. We'll ask them more Jordans. The Jordans are better. Yeah, Jordans. Are, oh no, they're all covered in ink. Clear a new path. An axe may come in handy. Nice. We can do something. Let's get physical and violent. This will definitely come in handy. R2 to attack. Frick yeah. The crater lied to us. Joey Drew. Clearly not me. Why would I do this? Why would I? Well, no, this ain't my doing. This is Joey's doing. I assume. Oh boy. So one thing right off the bat, I say I, I like Bendy. This game, Bendy and the Ink Machine, I like it. It's mysterious, it's creepy, and I can use a weapon. I don't have to run away all the time. I don't have to hide. I can kick some ass. I wish Atlas can take some notes. The first game, all you could do is just hide, use your camera, find some batteries, maybe a little shoving, but that's about it. <laughs> this, this is how you do it. Hell yeah. Look at that. Mr. One Punch or Mr. One Axe. Uh, read for good lore. Actually, Drew. Actually, Joey Drew turned his employees into. See that? Oh, reflex. That sounds like spoilers. That sounds like spoilers. I'm just saying, though. Joey Drew turned his employees into ink creatures. I'm just saying. That is lore, but that's spoilers. Now my mind's pre exploded. Dang. All right, let's cut through. Word. Yep. Yep. He's me he's messing with the devil. Oh god. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, sure. Scared the crap out of me, and then put in a cutscene or a loading screen, whatever. Chapter 2, The Old Song. Oh, my head. What happened? <sighs> and we're on the circle. Well, I guess nah. there's only one thing to do. Press on. See if I can find a way out. No, they did something to us, bro. Find a new exit, and axe may come in handy. I wouldn't be surprised if there's like a hex symbol on my back or something. Not spoilers. Are you uh, are you sure? Because think about it. A person who hasn't played Inky and the, Bank, Inky, Bendy and the Ink Machine, right? And then... Because look, I was saying, where's everybody? Where's everybody, right? But it, they didn't give me that information that they turned into monsters. But then you said they drew... Turn his employees into ink creatures. See, that hasn't been that context hasn't been provided yet into the gameplay. See, that sounds like spoilers. Yeah, I'm just saying that's kind of spoilers, because so far all I got was just empty studio, black magic, I assume, and then Bendy not looking wholesome. But do you see what I'm trying to get at? That I'm sorry, but yeah, no spoilers. Now I know what happened to the employees. Utility shaft nine. Hello? No, that woman came. This place is falling apart. He will set us free. This is chapter two. Y'all said that I could get hurt on this one, so I'm gonna go easy on the bacon soup right now. How did this place get so big? That's the thing, Henry. I'm going for another guess, but this has always been here. This is just another layer of the building. He appears from the shadows to rain his sweet blessings upon me. The figure of ink that shines in the darkness. I see you, my savior. I pray you hear me. Those old songs, yes, I still sing them. For I know you are coming to save me. And I will be swept into your final loving embrace. But love requires sacrifice. 
Sammy Lawrence. I the voice say, of Sammy Lawrence. Can I get an amen? That's not me, dude. Yeah, that sounds like a cult. Which I do not want to be part of. I honestly rather just... Go anywhere that is not in this place. This is just evil. Bendy and the train troubles. Can't mess with us. Also, when you finish Hello Neighbor Act 4, can you tell... Can I tell you some lore about it? Of course, because once I finish Act 4, I mean... I, I You know, there's going to be some parts I'm going to be confused on. But, yeah, feel free. Also, Nick, I apologize. I'll spoil you a bit on the lore, but if you want to leave the stream for my pleasure. No, bro, that's a bit exaggerated. You don't have to worry about that, bro. It's cool. Just no spoilers. That's it. That's it. That's cool. No worries. Yeah. Oh, actually, now I see it. That hair. Devil horns, right? <laughs> it was it was there all along. How can I not see it? And it's smelling way too much. Hello? Excuse me, can, can you help me? Hello? Wow. That that must be the, the voice guy, Mr. Sammy. Yeah, I'm not, I, I, I'm gonna leave him alone. Hey, yeah. Oh, wow. Hey, what the frick? Power to this gate somehow. Should be a couple switches nearby. Hey, let's like he's... Open it. Re redirect the power to the gate. Find three switches. I was gonna say, it looks like he's made out of bubble gum. Bubble gum, maybe some marble. Very interesting. Wow, he really likes Bendy. How do I? Ah. No, no, no. How do I? Okay, that does not work. That is cool. I will go redirect the power. Hopefully, I don't drown in this stuff. <laughs> Look at that. Now that we have an axe, we can break open doors. I wonder if we can crack through these. Dang it. It doesn't work. But nothing... Oh. There we go. That's one. There should be two more. I assume we can't go back all the way, can we? Never mind. Yes, we can. At least just a little bit. Ah, of course. Okay, so there. So we're stuck here because of the ink. But I'm glad I went back because I was able to find one out of three of those switches. So without a doubt, this guy who took the cardboard of Bendy definitely has powers. Because there was like no, there was like nowhere else he could go. Man says, Nenku, can you kiss me? No. That's weird. I don't do that. That's that's kind of sus. And like I said, para... How do you... What do you call it? Parasocial... Parasocial... I think that was called? Yeah, I don't do that. Yeah. Nope. I'm good. That's two. Now we need one more. Man said AO sus. <laughs> yeah. Too sus, yeah. Ah, you son of a gun. Ah, ha ha. It was behind the bacon soup. How did I miss this? Raise the gates. Yes, boss. Seeing that Bendy's not coming after me, I'll take this as a win. So, hell yeah. It's really dark in here. Oh, yeah. Super dark. More lore. So first, Joey installs this ink machine over our heads. Then it begins to leak. 
Three times last month we couldn't even get out of our department because the ink had flooded the stairwell. Joey's solution. An ink pump to drain it periodically. Now I have this ugly pump switch right in my office. People in and out all day. Thanks, Joey. Just what I needed. More distractions. These stupid cartoon songs don't write themselves, you know? In his office, that's where I need to go. Yeah, thank God for that guy. We need not 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 Bendy, but the the other guy, because the ink will be a very much a big issue. And it says the lighter side of hell. Yikes! I wish I could read this and play and just to hear what it sounds like. Just just curious, just to hear the tunes. It could be one of those songs where it sounds kind of gruesome in the titles, but then when you play the tunes, it's just like maybe not so bad. I gotta go. I can't help you. I yo yeah, what? Neko, don't read the chat. I beg you. I can't delete the message. I can't help you with that either. I don't know how to do that. You might have to Google that. <laughs> uh, music department director Sammy Lawrence. Oh, a familiar name. Caught in 4K. Oh, what the frick? Bendy in with Alice Angel. No, no, no. The, wait, this is a different person. Alice Angel. She sings, she dances, sent from above. So she's like the angel and Bendy's the demon. Hey, Zenith Blade. How's it going? Hello. Huh. Yeah, you know what would be a good jump scare if they were to just throw bend, um a corporate bandy just to poke out like really quick when you flick this on like a nice side cardboard of him just like hi <laughs> that would have been scary Damn, so we have two very crazy people. Sammy Lawrence and Mr. Drew. Henry Drews. But, yeah. Oh, boy. That's not good. It's bad enough that if your coworker is just a little cuckoo, but then having a boss that could be up there as well. No, bro. I, if I were him, go to another job. Let somebody know. So be like, hey, you'll go get the, um, the inspector to check up on this guy. This guy's a bit kind of, you know... Crazy. I would have left on day one. Well, actually, maybe day two, because once I settle and I'm not gonna just catch the vibes in day two, I'll be like, yeah, day one. I have, I had enough. I, I know what how this place works. I am out. It's creepy, and just very just bizarre. Oh wait, we came through there. Let's go this way. You're playing, then you're playing Bendy well, good luck if you're trying to understand the story. Yeah, that's not a, that shouldn't be an issue. I, I think I got a good gist of the, what's going on with the contents I've been giving. And in case if I if once I if I if I once I finish this game and I'm still lost, I can always look up the lore, so that helps too. Maybe Mr. Um, Mr. Map Pack can give me the lore if he if he has played the game, of course, because he's really good at delivering the information. Because I've seen his FNAF, not all of them, some of his FNAF videos for lore and Guards in a Ban Ban and uh, other games as well. Looks like the stairwell's flooded. If I'm going to get out of here, I need to find a way to drain it. Drain the stairwell, locate the pump control. Which is in the office. 
Oh, wait. I looked away for a second. What the frick? Oh, whoa, whoa. Creepy. Creepy. Oh, oh. Why are you... Nice. I can fight. Yes. Yes. It just takes two hits. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Oh, it comes back. Hey, hey. Buddy, stay down. All right. We got to hurry up. Open up. Damn. It's not this one. Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. Chill. It saved. And it opened. So that was supposed to happen. What's worse than one bendy? Two. Oh, my dude. It goes so much deeper. How deep? Like, super deep? Oh, snap. It's a cartoon. So it's a scaly and bendy. They're just like, oh, snap. Run away. Cool. I haven't forgotten about my objective. Kill the ink men. And I assume those were the employees, right? Because from what you guys said. Either that or just demons. Like, just separate demons. Nice. The recording booth. So this is how they did it back in the day, eh? They had the mics all the way up there. That's creepy. Recording. Really? What is this, bulletproof? So basically, five games and multiple spinoffs. And they're deep. But wait, there's only I only found two um, Bendy's. There's Bendy the Ink Machine and Bendy and the Revival of something. Where are the other three? I'm not call I'm not calling you a lie by any chance. I'm just curious, like where where can I find the other three of them? It may only be my second month working for Joey Drew, but I can already tell I'm gonna love it here. People really seem to enjoy my Alice Angel voice. Sammy says she may be as popular as. Bend me someday. These past few weeks, I voiced everything from talking chairs to dancing chickens. But this is the first character I really felt a connection with. She's a part of me. Alice and I, we're going places. Mm-hmm. <laughs> part of you, eh? Maybe that might come true with the help of Mr. Henry Drew. Oh, wait, so if I stay here, does it play the same tune? Nope, different. Guys, I'm a natural at this. <laughs> Professional. But honestly, uh, how do I play this, though? Lighter of the side of hell. I can interact with this, so that must be a good reason... Right? So, uh, let me guess, let me guess. So, I play the right tunes, and in return, this opens up. What if I use my axe instead? Ink poo. I should have known it was ink poo this whole time. There's two PC games and two mobile games, and then... Oh, wait. Oh, wait, mobile, mobile. Like cellular? PC, I understand. PC are games, but mobile games are just like a whole different thing. I don't know. That's crazy. I have to go look that up on, on Steam tonight. Also, the chapters count as games in themselves. There's five chapters and another spin-off coming out very soon. I think there's also a mobile game as well. It says the Zenit Blade. Dang, so this, this goes really deep. I'm not sure if this game is like, oh, a violin. Or is that a cello? Probably violent. Uh, I'm not sure if this is like the origins of the madness, but if there's five of them, one of them has to be like the beginning of how it went down, right? Because those are, because those, in my opinion, I think if it was a movie, those would be really popular. Like for instance, like there's this one movie called um, uh, Silence or 
quiet... Okay, let me give you the premise. A group of family members are survivors, and they have to stay quiet. And because why? There's these alien creatures that came from space, and they'll kill anything that makes a lot of noise, or any kind of noise, like enough to just, you can hear with the, with your ears. And these things are huge, tough, powerful skin, and the only way to kill them is when they open up their, their ears or their mouths or something. But, um, yeah. And now they're gonna make a day one where it all happened, and I'm looking forward to it. And I'm pretty sure everyone else was, like, really, like, already seen the first one, the second one. Like, who doesn't like a good Origins? You know, see how it all began. Because from the trailer, I, I it, it got my attention. It didn't give out too much, in my opinion, which is great. Because sometimes you don't want to get, like, Deadpooled. Where they show you all the jokes and all the best um, moments. But I can't wait. Thank you, thank you. I, I can do this all day. <laughs> but, oh, more. Oh, no, wait, that's a cello. It's a bigger one. The one the one I thought was a cello was actually a violin. Hell yeah. Oh, thank you, it's a quiet place. I don't know why I said silence. Yeah, a quiet place. Such a great movie. Absolutely outstanding. It's like if anyone says you can't make a movie without talking, impossible. Watch A Quiet Place. They did it perfectly. They got visuals, they got audio, they didn't chit chat a lot, but what you see was more than enough to work with. You know how they say a picture's are worth a thousand words? They did it justice. It was so intense. It raises your anxiety, especially on certain scenes once you see it. Yeah. If you haven't, if you want to, check out Quiet Place. It's so good. And I can't wait for the the day one of Quiet Place. Oh, burn up, damn it. So anyways, uh, locate the pump control. All right, so clearly this was not the way. The, the recording says something about the office. It had something to do with it, I believe. It's a very small place, so it's only a matter of time before I actually find it. Bada bing, bada boom. Oh, I wonder. Oh, I'm sorry, guys. I ruined your your pool table. Panty candles. Y'all crazy with this? Okay, y'all selling toys and candles. You guys have T-shirts. <laughs> but uh, there's gotta be something here, right? Besides this giant pool table. Lighter side of hell. Notes. I mean, there's nothing in here. I don't think. It's just a regular pool table. And of course, this very suspicious looking garage thingy. But it doesn't open up. Hmm. Look for the pump. Wait. Locate the pump control. Man said balls. What about them? Ah, balls, of course. How do I... Oh, snap. Maybe this is the way. Oh, dude, come on. It was like right there. Ain't no way. Oh, there, we got one in. All right, we got to get the other pieces. Let's see, how do we do this? All right, it's all about that angle. Nice. Another. Oh. Dang. Also, Dr. Reflex, yay, you're back. Neku, what's good? Hello. Maybe go where the all the, the ink was setting. He's back with the milk. All right. I'm off. Okay, I think he's speaking facts. You said go back to the where the ink was sitting. You mean here? Oh, wow. Oh, God. 
What did I thought it was a good idea? Honestly? Yeah. <laughs> not not a good idea. Back with the milk unlike dad. You know, it's kinda of funny. If you're gonna if you're a dad and you know how the meme is he never came back because he went to get milk. Bring bring more than just milk. I don't know, bring a bring a whole party. Like a, a not a party, but um gifts. Uh, what? How many? However many years they gone missing in your life, give you presents. Like, okay, let's say they've been gone for your life for 15 years. Give me 15 years worth of presents, and 15 years worth of child support, and uh, 15 years worth of gallon of milk. <laughs> it's not there. Not there. Maybe it's over here. I. It doesn't hurt to check, right? Thankfully, I can still move around a bit. Well, there goes my Jordans. And this is where we get the juice, but I don't think we can mess with that anymore. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. You're in pain? Well, socks. Am I getting closer or am I getting cold? I think I'm getting cold, if I'm being frank. Dang it. <laughs> or perhaps. Ink poo man. Yeah, so much. I wish I could flush them. But I, I feel I feel bad for these souls. These guys are just normal people. Excuse me, like you and I. Doing their job, trying to get paid. And then and they become into monsters. Oh my god. I swear if I see Henry, I'm gonna whack him. Not like whack him but like beat him up like what are you thinking what were you thinking look at these are your employees they had friends and families and and um dreams and lives and you took it away just so, something must have happened to him he he wasn't always like this right he must have been a reasonable individual then maybe somebody Cast a spell or something. Because why would you do all this? It don't make no sense. How can you be crazy and run a business? Oh, but wait, wait. Oh, Henry. Oh, I'm sorry. I am Henry. Uh, not Henry. Um, Joey. I'm sorry. Joey Drew. Why would Joey do this? It doesn't make no sense. I meant to say Joey, not. <laughs> yes, Henry. My character is crazy. Why would I do this? Is it? I, I I don't. Maybe I'm missing something. There, cartoons are on. It just says. Oh wait, hold on. I have a better idea. I have a better idea. Let me just read the. Not read, but um. No, no, no. I had it right. Let me go read the audio like I did before. After I peeked at this corner real quick. Never mind. I was just. I was like, did I been there before? Right there. Joey's solution, an ink pump to drain it periodically. I have this ugly pump switch right in my office. Hint, hint. Oh my god, I'm so blind. It was right here. I just had to turn my neck. I found I found the way out, guys. I found it. Henry is crazy for returning. Yeah. Maybe maybe he didn't anticipate any of this, right? Obviously, he he's he caught the I forgot what was the 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 early context, but it was something like what was it? Joey's secrets helping uh helping him out. It's like oh okay, um, let me go come back. Just helping out a friend. Check out his secrets. Must be zesty, right? And then it it, it was awful. It was terrible. <laughs> Demons, inks, monsters. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. I don't. I, I'm. I'm pretty sure Henry did not anticipate any of this. He thought this would be just a regular, just, just coming to the office. But yeah, he, you're not wrong. He is crazy to come back here. The infirmary. It says, 
Anyone found faking illness will be docked a full week's wage. Damn, not sick, not paid. Golly, a whole week? That's a bit harsh. Maybe, maybe like for the day, but a whole week? Nah, dude. I, if, if that happened to me, I quit. I can, I can use that time and go find another job and get paid. I don't know. At, I don't know. If there's a Burger King in their world. Cause this is like what this feels like 19 like the 1900s like early 1900s well yeah that, that's kind of nah nah I, I quit i'm done i'm done joey i'm going to find another job that pays me well gives me respect you hear we have bendy model sheets disgust angry sad happy do not let joey see this but they all have the same expression. So he's he has all kinds of emotions, but it's just one face. Zenipolis says, shiver me timbers, that's scary, no pay for all the whole week. That's tragic. Is that even legal? No, no, I'll, I'll call in the... I'll call in the right people for that. Like, yo, they're trying to take away my pay just because he thinks I'm faking an illness. That's ridiculous. I see the reason Harry came back is because Joey sent him down here. Six said, Dr. Reflex. Why down here? That's a good question. Another day, another dollar. Don't forget to punch in. It could save your job. Or in my case, my life. Well, there's the pump switch, all right. But that's one hell of a leak blocking the door, though. If I could just stop that ink from flowing, maybe I can get in. It says... Office of Sammy Lawrence, Music Department Director. Let me pop this. I was going to get my dustpan from the hall closet the other day, and guess what? I can't find my stupid key. It's like they disappeared in the thin air or something. All I can think of is that they must have fallen in one of the garbage cans I was making my rounds last week. I just hope nobody tells Sammy, because if he finds out I lost my keys again, I'm again. This happened more than once? He said near the trash can, so that's a big old hint. It's time to be it's time to believe. And there's the pump control. Alright, so it's not here, it's somewhere out here. Trash cans. Here's one right here. Doesn't It's not this one, guys. It's clearly the other trash can. It's set in the nineteen hundreds, I think so, back when it was no more, I think. It definitely gives that vibe, doesn't it? Because imagine this being the early 2000s and we still have this. <laughs> what the hell is this? <laughs> this is something you probably see at church. These old, like, pianos. Hmm. Trash cans, of course. It's not this one. So, does that mean I'm wearing a tuxedo? Because I feel like in the 1900s, they had, like, all, everyone, all the males had suits. Suits and hats. And the women had, like, dresses. And... What was it, like? I'm, just, I'm just trying, to, trying to think more of their fashion. It's like, they, they had a nice sense of fashion. It was quite nice. You're not going to see nobody wearing some jeans. At least I don't think. And some... And some pajamas out on the streets now. Everyone has like a certain style of clothing. It's kind of retro. I feel like I can pull off a tux. Not, maybe not a tuxedo, but like a like a like a suit suit, like a business suit. And then the dad's like in his living room reading the newspaper. And then later, maybe uh, hearing the radio with the family, like their their idea of entertainment. And then going to the movies, like, it's like, like, I actually could think of it. What kind of movies did they have back then? Huh. Black and white? I'm, now I'm thinking, when, when did Wizard of Oz came out? Because that's when they got crazy, because I think Wizard of Oz, don't quote me on this, just guessing, might have been the first movie. And I don't know, I'm going to Google this. Hold on, I'm, I'm curious now. What is the first movie to get color uh, let's see google says 
I knew it. The Wizard of... No, wait. The Wizard of Oz? No. The first movie ever made in color was 1908. God damn. That's... Golly. That's a long time ago. The first commercially produced film in natural color was A Visit to the Seaside. 1908. The eight-minute British short film used uh, kind color process to capture the series of shots of Brighton Southern English seafront. But also has like an image of... um. Wizard of Oz in the middle, and it has like two other images. So I, I, I assume the first one is a visit to the seaside, Wizard of Oz, and then there's a third one that got color. But that's crazy! Holy crap! 1908, damn. So back then, it's just, it was just straight up black and white, and then 1908 was like, Ch guys, check this out, Shazam, color, because that that must have been a huge deal. I guess in our case, it, it says we have like really good visuals, like you know, 4K and HD audio, and uh, and and, the, and you can see color. Maybe our new upgrade will be just like 4D or something. No, maybe not 4D, but you know, like maybe like 3D, but not 3D without the glasses. It's, it's like almost like you can jump in there. Like it's like you know what I mean. It's like a whole different level because. Seeing all your shows and movies and commercials in black and white, it's, you're used to it, right? It's like, it's, it's oh, going to catch that black and white ad or, or that, that one movie or that TV show, black and white. But when they switched to color, holy crap, everyone was probably all on top of their tippy toes and clapping and, and like watching it maybe five times, telling their friends like, yo, this movie has color. It's like, it's like, bro, it's like we're watching a play. <laughs> oh, man, that must have been revolutionary. But yeah, for, for me, one of those months was when my cousin introduced me to HDMI because I, I used to play everything in the three colors like red, white, and yellow. And then hearing it from my TV, the audio doesn't sound good. The visuals don't look that you know, like perfect. But he, when he switched me to HDMI on my PlayStation, I was I had my doubts, but I never went back. Wider screen. Just crystal clear visuals. The audio was almost like not contained in a box. Huge. That was my that was my black and white to color moment. It was it was incredible. Now I'm hoping we can have a movie or something that can just jump us to the next level of of you know of I don't know, maybe it's the right word, cinema. Yeah. He probably wear torn clothes. Sison, he most likely underpaid worker. Dang. Wait, what happened? Yo, man said he. You said AO. Let me check. What did Doctor Reflex said? Uh, da -da -da -da. Man, it's like AO. Wait, what did he say? Con in 4K. I didn't see it. I was too busy just going on about what I was saying. Con in 4K. What? All right, I'm gonna just keep playing. Y'all let me know. All right, so let's see. Trash can, Neku. Trash can. Don't forget the objective. It literally says right here. Retrace Wally's steps. And a pair of keys. He deleted it? He learned how to delete it. Congratulations. It's a shame I wasn't able to read it. But from the context of the AOs and Conan 4 case, I assume it was zesty. Like, super sus. Nothing there. Or in the world are these trash cans? All right, hold on. Let me let me think. Come on, Neko, be smart. All right. He lost his keys at a trash area. What? Oh, I wish I knew his name. Maybe is maybe his workstation, right? It's gotta be where he was working at. What would it be anywhere else? Shall we tell him? Don't tell him. All right. You don't have to tell me. I was just curious. I can, I, I can make some guesses, but I, you guys don't have to tell me. <laughs> Should we tell them? No, nah, it's cool. Oh, unless you're telling me about the keys, then, you know, if it's the keys, you know, you know, you, you know I'm all ears for that one, though. Let me catch that. So Subtitles. There. There's the hint. It's the hall. Oh, hold on. 
dustpan from the hall closet. It's a closet. That's not what it is. Where is it? Uh, that's not it. The dustpan from the hall closet. This is not the hall closet. That's where we need to go later. That's a separate matter. Is this the hall closet? This looks more like a chill room. So I'm going to guess that's not the hall closet. Just get I'm um, just guessing from Oh, I found it. <laughs> I found it. I was gonna say I'm just gonna guess it's probably here. How do I Nice This does not feel like a place where you would drop the keys. I, you know what I had envisioned? I thought it would be like a little room filled with, you know, cleaning supplies, like the generator, the generator, the janitor to clean stuff, like in that area, next to the brooms, in the dustpans. Not in here of all places, but I'm glad I, I took a chance. All right. Anyways, got the keys. Moving on. Hopefully, Bendy. Um. Doesn't I look, Bendy? I I'm seriously, I'm not the bad guy. I'm just here on a request. That's it. So ease up. Ah. Every artistic person needs a sanctuary. Joey Drew has his, and I've got mine. To enter, you need only know my favorite song. The bass fiddle sings with deep articulation. The banjo playfully clucks. The banjo once again strums its melody. The drum thunders in triumph. Sing my song, and my sanctuary will open to you. Alright. Bass, banjo, banjo, drum. Bass, banjo, banjo, drum. Bass, banjo, banjo, drum. Bass. Alright, I'm sorry. I, my, my memory is bad, so I have to keep repeating it. Bass. All right. I know there's something I've got to do in here, but I feel like I'm missing something. What does that supposed to mean? We have it all here. All right, bass is one, right? And then banjo twice. And then drums, which I assume is the thing he's talking about, right? Because there is no drums in here. There's a piano, trash, and every other instrument Every other instrument you can think of. Oh, wait. I lied. Here it is. I said corrected. How did I miss you? Did it work? <laughs> Open sesame. Learn Sammy's favorite song. Oh, unless that was not the bass. Right? Maybe this is the bass. Hmm. Let me try to drum one more time. Maybe it's like. Let me think. It was bass, banjo, banjo, then drums. Bass. Dang. Okay. Okay. Let me let, let me get out these sticky notes. I'm gonna write it down. Make my life a little bit easier. Unlucky. I honestly thought I had it. Every artistic person okay. needs a sanctuary. Joey Drew has his base fiddles. Mine. To enter, you need only know my favorite song. The base fiddle sings with deep articulation. The banjo playfully clucks. The banjo, once again, strums its melody. The drum thunders in triumph. Sing my song, and my sanctuary will open to you. I got it. But it's the same. Bass, fiddles, banjo, banjo once again, drum thunders, or just drums. Uh, y'all, is it just me, or do I see a face on that guitar? 
You do? Well, we're about to go back, so we're about to see. Oh, very odd. I, I did what it told me to, but it doesn't quite... No, nothing happened. No, a, a ding noise like, hey, congratulations, you succeeded. You said it was the guitar with the face. That's a banjo, that's a drum. You mean this? Guitar, guitar. I don't see no guitar though. I see everything else. But, okay, so... Bass. I'm gonna try this. Bass. <laughs> Hopefully. Banjo. Banjo. Drum. Learn, learn Sammy's favorite song. Didn't work out? Alright, then I, it has to be this one. And then pluck. And then drum. But he did say something. He said something earlier. Something's missing. That's what Mr. Um, Henry said. I don't see a face caught again. What are you talking about? I am so lost. Oh my goodness, you guys are so throwing me off. <laughs> oh, he was talking about you? Xenoblin, I was that reflex? Okay. Alright, uh, hey guys, uh, guys, so what am I doing wrong? It mentioned bass fiddles, the banjo, and then the banjo again, and then the drums. There's a woman It. Wait a minute. Maybe it's the level of... Because it has, like... Like, levels of tones? It has to be that. He was very descriptive. Ah, oh, dang. All I wrote was just bass, fiddles, banjo, banjo once again, and then, yeah. That... Ah, oh, dang. God dang it. Instruments. It had to be instruments. Why couldn't it just been something else? Neku, get this piece of item, put it here, and turn it sideways. Hold on, this requires some writing. Alright, so first off, delete this, and then write this. Okay, so I got. I need the third Every part. Every artistic person needs a sanctuary. Joey Drew has his, and I've got mine. To enter, you need only know my favorite song. The bass fiddle sings with deep articulation. The banjo playfully plucks. The banjo once again strums its melody. The drum thunders in triumph. Sing my song. And my sanctuary will open to you. Okay, I wrote it. Word for word. Or at least the important pieces. Also, man, what are you talking about? I didn't say anything. Who's telling you? You. What? I think I'm going to say what previous of Dr. Reflex's message was. Why? Does it matter? I, that was like so ages ago. You know what you should, you know what you should help me with? <laughs> help me crack this puzzle. <laughs> That's- I think that should be more important. Alright, bass fiddle sings with deep articulation. What the frick does that mean? Alright, bass. The banjo playfully plucks. The banjo once again strums its melody. 
The drum thunders in triumph. This is a drum. Learn Sammy's first song. What do you think, game? I am trying. No, bro, I can't hold back. Hmm. I think two E's. We were we all lost the puzzle with that puzzle, dude. Here I am. The bass fiddle sings with deep articulation. The banjo playfully plucks. The banjo once again trumps its melody. The drum thunders in triumph. Oh, that's what you said? Don't have to reflex said Neku's daddy? Oh, oh, that is kind of sauce. Uh, no. I am nobody's daddy. Uh, also, I swear I can't freaking do this part. I always have to look up tutorial. Yeah, I, and I, I know, I know. I know. Makes feelings about the tutorial, but I'm gonna have to hit this one up too. To the tutorial. Just this once. Uh, unless I have to do it again for. Wait, anyways. Alright. Sammy's. <laughs> Just for, for the sake of consistency. Sanctuary. No, 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 wait. Learn. Sammy's. I'm pretty sure you two got me on this one. Wow, four years ago. Jesus. All right, so let me just make this bigger, and then y'all can see what I see. I'm sorry, I know, I know, but I, I, I just really want to get this out the way. It's almost the two-hour mark, and I really want to cut through. All right. Let me skip ahead a little bit. Wait, where is he going? What? So he turns on the projector. Right. One. Banjo. Drum. What? Okay, okay. What the frick? Sammy, that was not on the notes. <laughs> wow. Okay, okay. I just have to repeat those steps. All right, let me let me let me rewound. It was bass first. No, 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 no. Actually, it was projector first. I guess I had to play the cartoon with audio. Uh okay. I'm I'm still trying to wrap my head around. How does that make sense? There. So it should work this time. All right, there we go. Let me pause it. All right, so I, sorry, it's just my short term memory so bad. I swear. Underlay, underlay, underlay. Okay. Banjo. Then the bass. Banjo, bass. Drum. Okay. Banjo. Bass. Drum. Violin. I have another idea. Maybe, call me crazy, but I think his notes were probably different than mine. <laughs> that has to be it. Right? Uh, uh, yeah, because his were different. His hairs were completely different. Also, Neko the driver smells my fries. What? Hey, how's it going, y'all? Neko, I'm on my way home. Oh, for real? Safe driving home. Also, go to the cassette again. And what is that thing again? Yeah, I'm gonna try. I'm gonna do the same thing, but the difference is. Oh, shoot, wrong one. I'm gonna play my notes, the ones they give me. His had to been different. So, anyways, uh, bass. Banjo, banjo, then drum. Okie dokie, so bass. Banjo, banjo. Drum. There we go. My favorite song. Into the Sanctuary. I just had to turn on the cartoon. Who would have knew? 
Also, Neku, what's your anime and your profile pick from That's from Miss Kobayashi's Dragon Maid? Really, um, it's a really great show, but it's an acquired taste because some people are kind of iffy about it, which I totally understand. And that's um, Miss Toru, one of the secondary main characters right next to Miss Kobayashi. A really great show. They have a second season, even a game, which is like, whoa, I haven't played it yet, but it's on my list. Um, also, I can't help you with Chapter 2, but can you help me with your Chapter 3 and Chapter 4? Yeah, I don't need help. I'm good. Um, but if, if you're asking me to help you, I can't really help you on that. If it's Banding the Ink Machine, I this is my first time playing it, so I can't really give you any tips and tricks. But maybe you can ask the others. <laughs> also, Neko the Driver smells my fries. How do you know? <laughs> Did you ask him? I hope he didn't, because that would be kind of weird. Sing a happy song, whistle a merry tune, wait for his arrival, he's coming very soon. Oh boy. Flow. Find the second valve. And that's it, just find a second valve, but this still kind of bothers me. Ill. <laughs> Why is there a toilet here? This does not make sense. Mm hmm. Oh God! Oh my God! Jesus! Oh my God! Stop that! I, I think I got her. I might have to get some bacon soup real soon. Back up! I warn you. You don't want this fight. Oh man. <laughs> yeah, they're they're finally pushing back. The player's progressing. We must stop him now. Second valve. Where in the world do we get that? Is that over here? Yes. Oh uh, wait, no, I lied. This is a closet. Give me that. Yummers. But that's the pump control. Okay, so maybe it's not here, but it's somewhere. He said it himself, now he is hungry. Okay, maybe he meant like, I got it. Okay, I smelled your food, or you said fries, right? But it was like in a bag, so maybe he smelled it from a distance. I don't think he opened up your food and just like sniffed it straight up, because that would be absolutely disgusting. That has to be it, right? Nah, bro. I'm not. I'm not eating those fries if he put his nose on top of that. Cause what if his snot goes in it, like dry snot? Nope. <gasps> ah. Anyone from faking an illness would not get a full week's pay. Uh, not will will not get a full week's pay. Nope. So this is the infirmary room. Oh, no, there's no valve. Where did it go? What are you talking about, Henry? It's right there. You just have to believe. <laughs> uh, and there's another bit. It says A F P H C A. Cool. Please wait. Sure. Imagine if I was bleeding. Doctor, I need your help. Please wait. There's two more people after you. Okay, I'll just bleed out. <laughs> work hard, work happy. Hey, Bendy. Oh, oh my god. I didn't know I could do that. <laughs> oh, I am so sorry. Ah, he's gonna kill me for that. Whoops. Uh, also, yeah, Ill. Ill is right. No more day in the 30s. He smelled for a distance. That's so weird, though. Down here, we're all sinners. I see something. And then we have to go that way. Uh, oh, snap. Yeah, it has our valve. And it has a hat, too. The sheep will come to slaughter. But who's the sheep? Is it me? Lighter side of hell, same same music, no thingy. <gasps> Lore. 
I love the quiet. And that's hard to come by in these busy times. And yeah, sure, it, it may stink to high heaven down here, but it's just perfect for an old lyricist like me. Sammy's songs always got some bounce, but uh, if I didn't get away once in a while, they'd never have any words to go with them. So I'll keep my mind to singing and uh, my nose closed. Okay, he's um. Uh... He likes to keep to himself. He's like, why would I be upstairs with a bunch of, you know, loud individuals? Not loud individuals, but, you know, crowded with the others. Down here, smelly, but at least have some space to myself. Peace and quiet. That may have been him. The one who took my valve, that could have been him. Because there's nobody else here. At least, as far as I know. It's a shame we have to go, um, beat him up. I'm, I'm, I'm helping the world heal by destroying Bandy. <laughs> and there he is. Hey! Hi! Can I get... Okay. What does this do? Absolutely nothing. It's Jerry the Ink Poo Man. Scary Bandy Wendy. Mandy Candy. Gotcha. And, Nick, what character is your... Profile again, it's slowly this time. Okay, it's um Toru. Toru from Miss Kobayashi. That's uh that's the dragon lady. What? Sing with me. I'm not the best singer, so can I dance for you? No? Ah, I see, I see. We're supposed to make a goal there. Unless we killed them already. Oh, we killed them already! Oh, how convenient! Oh, as weird as that may sound out of context. Sorry I had to do that. Nice hat, though. He's so casual about it. I love it when a plan comes together. I, that, I was, that was an honest, super lucky accident. I was going to say, I'm going to have to send him up in that direction, crush him with the crate. Bam. But, luckily we already had that done for us. Don't hurt Jerry. Yeah, I had to. Jerry was becoming very difficult. Don't worry. Uh, I will help him by stopping... Joey from being evil. Yes. <laughs> Don't worry, your death was not in vain, Jerry. You will be remembered. At least I will remember. So yeah. Where the frick is this Jerry guy? Not Jerry guy, but um Joey. I ain't talking about Wheeler. He's about to get Bam! Slapped. Okay, that should do it. Return to Shammy's office. That's... What is that again? Is that over here? Sammy! Oh, right! Sammy's office! Duh! Of course! I already forgot. Nice! Also, hey, sorry for killing your cardboard pieces. But that's about it. We go in there, pump the control, and uh, maybe look over here, because that looks very useful. Maybe a map. I think. But I hate to say it, but I'm going to have to wrap it up. It's already two hours. So, if I, if I may, Bandy. 2017, how come I never play this? This game is up my alley. I love being a good story. And the fact that I can fight back, which makes it amazing. And it's it's okay, so for, for horror games, I'm not like quite there yet as a super horror fan, but I'm getting there. Because most of the games I played are are just like um, battle royales, multiplayer, FPS games, anime, visual novels. Yes. So as you can see from what I'm trying to say, my world takes is it's expanding of all the genre of games. But horror games I have played before, but not much back in 2017. But currently at this moment, 
if you look at my playlist of games I've played so far, I, I've been trying to get into that. Trying to get used to it because scary, scary games are scary, but they have their uniqueness. And especially when they have some lore to it, some richness. And I'm hoping I can play this one game really soon. Spoilers, Grey, Grey Visits or something. It has like a cover of an alien and I'm just like, bro, I'm a sucker for aliens. And um, I don't think I've seen the trailer yet, but I've seen the cover. But uh, yeah, it looks kind of neat and obviously scary. What would it, I highly doubt it's a, a fun and an adventure game with that, with that cover on the game because it has a big gray alien. So anyways, yeah, trying to expand my my genre of, of games, especially into horror. And I think this counts as one of them because it has a lot of scary features. So yeah, man says love and kiss. No, I don't do that, bro. Um. Also, Neku destroying the bendy cutouts. They're you're making bendy angrier. I would not be surprised if that happens, bro. Whatever happens to me in the game, that's my fault. I'll hold that out. I'll yeah. But anyways, thank you guys for watching. I'm gonna probably play this probably Monday for certain because I I'm actually. <laughs> I'm actually more curious. I love it. Everything is so good. I want to get more of those lore tapes. This right here. It's it's so good. I I, I love it, especially with subtitles. Because sometimes you know you you think you hear something and then you miss it and and it can ruin the lore. But I have subtitles, and so far I love what I'm hearing so far. And also, I want to see more Bendy. As weird as that may sound, I only got a quick glimpse of him in his in his weird inky form. But I want to I want to I want more. I want more lore, but yeah, anyways, you guys are the best, have a good weekend, take care, stay safe, I'll be back on Monday with more Bendy in the Ink Machine, and I'll definitely continue uh, finishing Act 3 of Hello Neighbor, and hopefully we can get to Act 4, because holy crap, once again, I, t I take back what I said, that game is actually hard, not easy, very hard and uh yeah but still fun nonetheless but that's it have a good weekend bye take care thank you guys for tuning in and uh peace out from yours truly